Hey everybody, it's Dino with One Tom Plumber. I hope you've had a great new year. We're ready to start 2022 with a great new video. This is one, this one's really cool because it's so incredibly easy. When you get into the bathtub and you start draining it, don't you feel like one of the most annoying things is when it gets a little clogged up, it starts going down slower, that water. So I got a great product that's so inexpensive, so easy to use, it's gonna make your bath and shower tub life a lot less hairy. Clog drains in your tub and shower are just a nightmare, right? When something does clog that thing up, it's, it's with disgusting hair and God knows what else it goes down there and gets trapped. Eventually you get that slow moving water. Eventually even that backs up. And you're constantly having to go in, undo the drain, open it up, either uh, use a, a tool or some kind of device like an auger to unclean it. But what about if we could keep that stuff from going in there in the first place? The tool I'm talking about is called a tub shroom. You've probably seen it online. It's even one of those products that's as seen on TV, but it works tremendously and it's so inexpensive. I've tried this out myself. I want to show you how to do it. I have to remove this metal drain lid or drain gate grate. And it's real easy. You just take a screwdriver, you unscrew it, and you pop it right off. You can use a screwdriver to pop it off if it sticks a little bit, like mine does. But uh, what you'll see in there, let me get a flashlight for you. What you're going to see in there is basically a drain. That's all it is. You'll notice that it doesn't um, have a stopper or anything like that. That's actually included up here. That's where the drain mechanism is. So the stopper is behind there. That's why you can't see it now. It's back in the drain. But all you have to do now is take the tub shroom, which I'm going to show you. which I'm gonna show you is this item here. It's made out of stainless steel. You notice uh, it is rust and corrosion resistant, which is great. And it has this gasket at the bottom. And that gasket's gonna allow it to fit into a standard drain size, which mine happens to be. That standard is one and a half to one and three quarters inches. But it also, let me get that for you. It also comes with a couple of uh, extender gaskets that allow you to go a little bit less than that and a little above that in case you have a non-standard drain. So that's one of the things you want to look at. Now all you do is pop it in, make sure it's secure. It's always going to rest above the drain hole. It's always going to be about a half inch to an inch above that. That's on purpose because we want water to continue flowing through there. But these little holes will trap any kind of hair and keep them from coming out. So you put it in, you just keep it like that. It's gonna be loose, no big deal. Uh, the gas will keep it sealed. And basically you'll turn on the water and everything continues to go down, as you can see. And your stopper mechanism will continue to work as you'll also see that'll fill up oh i'm gonna get all wet here clean my but you can see the water still standing so it had no interference whatsoever with your stopper mechanism and all it does is trap that hair going down hair is the biggest problem in showers and everything and the way to remove it if you ever need to remove it is just Take it off and put your grate back on. One more thing. Take a few showers, three, maybe four showers. After about three or four, just pop it off. See what hair and debris is on there and simply remove it and throw it in the trash. That's all you do and then pop it back on. It was well under $20 as far as I remember. Uh, got it online because I just wanted to try it out. A uh, plumber friend of mine said it's actually a really good product, and from what I've noticed in its use, 
certainly its installation. It's super easy. It does actually work, unlike some of those other as seen on TV kind of products. But if you like that uh, tip, I'll bring you more products that maybe you'll be interested in for your DIY plumbing around the house. In the meantime, if you like this video, please like, share, comment. We always appreciate the comments and the sharing in particular. Um, helps us with our Google ranking so we can reach more people and help them as well. This is Dino with One Tom Plumber. I'll see you next week.